dodged. There's that movement that like he's deep in the court, a pretty good shot there. He's stretched, he moves back to the Sydney side. Sees it early, two or three big strides, and he's got time to take a full-blooded swing. Drop shot has to be just about perfect. Come forward. Sensational. Phenomenal athleticism. That's magnificent. It's good tennis. A lot of points are being won. Team Germany. Power is the order of the day, but we're seeing some good court craft too. Good hustle there from Sonego, but to no avail. Well, guys, he did chip that forehand return back, but it just flew. Unreal. How to rectify the mistake from the previous point. And there it is. Look, he's, he's virtually in the tram lines, hitting these forehands. Not an easy shot. Brave in the end from the Italian. For a set point for Team Italy. And that is a raucous response from the crowd as well. What an opening set of tennis. High octane stuff. 67 minutes, Lorenzo Sonigo takes it on the breaker. Tennis at his absolute finest here in Sydney. I can get it done my way. Sometimes they're just not willing to experiment. Opens it up. That's not good enough. And it could be costly.
And he's got it. The previous game felt that it was important, and so it's proved to be. And the camera's panned to him just to make him feel good. <laughs> oh, it's in. Hit that with no pressure on him down a couple of set points. Cheeky. Stylish and successful. Off that serve in terms of the cut down the tee. Yeah. Out of nowhere, he has produced. Yeah. Late night beckons here in Sydney, potentially. Team Italy won the opening match. Team Germany square up the second match of the night. And it has been a thoroughly enjoyable... There, but what I really loved about this forehand, he had some nice shape on the ball. And yeah, there was a little bit of risk. It didn't seem like as risky as he was a little bit, you know, maybe a set ago. That had some nice shape. And Game. Team Germany. That's the perfect start. Game. Alcaraz can do in terms of endurance training, and I think tennis is a running game. Nicely done there from Zverev. Beautiful touch on the back end. Well, make efforts. Whereas I think for the taller players, and I sometimes think, you know, I kind of think for a guy like John Isner, uh, how how could he train? Oh, nicely done there from Zverev. Once again, it's that silky movement to the ball. Only in matches. So good. What an absolute diagonal dagger of a return that was from the German. From Zverev, he needs a bit of help. Crowd's going to love that. What a perfect outcome. Skimmed the net and stayed so low. Nothing the Italian could sort of latch onto. Well, in the contest of the contest between Italy and Germany, that was the perfect outcome as it keeps the mixed doubles that's to come alive. But in isolation as a singles match on its own, it was exceptional. Another come from behind victory for Zverev. That's 15 out of 16 in recent times for the German. And given his uh, tough start to 2023, when we last saw him here in Sydney, he is gonna be ecstatic about that win.